Honestly, Sylvie, if you don't like giving your name to people, maybe you should find a different job where you don't work for the public. Maybe you should also find a different job. How about that? Don't judge me. But I'm not doing anything that's against my job. You need my driver's license? Yeah. Really? Yeah. To, en to enter in a town hall? Yeah. Wow. Do you do that with everybody? Yeah. Every single person that comes into town hall, you, see, you, you, you tell them, you make them give you your driver's license. Yeah. Did you know that's a violation of the Fourth Amendment? Your business has stopped, then you can leave. Re res right? Respectfully, Malarkey, you don't, you do not tell me when my business is finished. Absolutely. Hey, what's up, guys? Long Island Audit here, back again with another video. Today we are at the North Hempstead Town Hall here in North Hempstead, New York, Nassau County, Long Island. We are here today to peacefully exercise our First Amendment right to film in public and publicly accessible areas and to ensure that our public officials and public servants respect that right. Let's get into it. Excuse me? You're yeah, yeah, I am recording. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry? I can't hear you. No, no. Thank you, though. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good holiday. Excuse me, guys. Can I help you? Um, no, thank you, ma'am. Thank you, I'm okay. Are you recording? Yes, I am. Re I am recording. Yeah. Why? I'm just recording, ma'am. That's all. No, no, I, I sure can record in a government office for sure. Yeah, for sure. No, I, I don't need anything at this time, ma'am. Thank you. Yeah, I'm, I'm not in any kind of restricted area or anything like that, so... Excuse me? I said I'm not in any kind of restricted area. I'm in a public you building. You can come into a public office and, and video. Yes, I can. Okay. I, I, I'm not going to argue. Where's... You, Jerry? You, you shouldn't argue. Can you explain this man? He can't just walk in our office and sit here videotaping us? He's not here for anything? He's just in our office videotaping. Hey, Jerry, if you could explain... Uh, I'm sure you didn't, you didn't... You haven't given me a hard time now, so uh, I'm sure you know... Uh, oh. If they don't want you to videotape them, they don't videotape Well, that office you can. That's New York State. That's um, all these direct offices. That registrar's office. So uh -huh. you can't, all those vital records are private, so you can't record Yeah, but it, it's open to the public. So anything that's open to the public, I can record. No, because we, we talk personal matters in there with oh, people on the phone and stuff. It's privacy. Yeah. yeah. Not do that's, that's, that's not right. true. Anyway, Jared, that's, can you please? That's not true. You're the, you're the security guard. You need to do something. Ma'am. You, you, you should you should allow Jerry just, not not to not to put his job in his. Don't go in the office and stay out of the office. You can't come in yeah. and videotape. Us. I'm sorry. You can't. No, you have no but reason to. I, yeah, I can. You I do, can. and I do have a reason, ma'am. What is your reason? It's a constitutionally protected reason, ma'am. But oh you just walk you just really? walked in here. But what did you walk in here for? I'm 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 gonna tell you, Jerry, what I'm here to do. Ready? I'm here. I'm gathering. Con I'm a journalist, independent journalist, gathering content for a story. So that's what I'm, well, I'm letting you know my they're purpose. Complaining about you recording the that's, record. I mean, they can complain all they like. It's not really. Then don't record them. So now they're 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 refusing services to uh, the public by locking the door. That's that's definitely. Yeah, I told Jerry. I told Jerry. Okay, can you tell me? Yeah, sure. I'll let you know. Just just because this 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 woman over here seems to be escalating things. I'm an inde I'm an independent journalist. I'm gathering content for a story. Mm -hmm. So I'm just videotaping in your town hall here, in our town hall. Mm -hmm. And that's all I'm doing. And what they're doing right now. And may I ask who you are and what position you hold here? Or no? Yes, you can ask. Oh, you're not going to tell me. Well, just like you're allowed to do that, I guess I'm allowed to also... I don't think so. On, only because you're a public employee, so your name is public information, and you work for the public. Yeah, and you wear name tags. Mm -hmm. Exactly, so... 
Great. No, I'm just I'm just trying to assess I'm just whether. I'm going to call the town attorney's office and our public safety officer to make sure that this is allowable. Sure, yeah, because you could do from that. From my understanding, it's not. So well, I'm just going to go ahead. It's a and good do that. it's a good education experience but, for everybody. Right, but you know, you get a lot further, you know, with honey rather than with vinegar, right? So if you need any have information, have I, have I, uh, if you needed I, anything, it's a lot easier but, to have, speak to any of us. But ma'am, have have I have I been disrespectful to any of you here? No, I haven't. Reporting just, it, that, is not that's, usually something that that's is not done disrespect. In a government office. So. Yeah, no, just you're. Hold on one second. Let me just give a you're couple mistaken, calls. But okay. And then let me just you could do whatever you'd like. Yeah. Okay. Just so you know that your your employees here are denying services to the public by locking their door. So you know that's not a it's not a good look for them. Town that's, attorney's office said to turn it off, so turn it off. Yeah, no, I'm not going to do that. And if you're not going to turn it off, then I'm just going to ask you to leave. You can ask me to leave, Jerry. That's fine. But I'm, I'm sorry, not, I have to ask you. To I, leave. Un I understand that. But what I'm, I'm going to explain to you just one one Listen, thing is I, that I, 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 I don't want to hear anything. I mean, I'm told to you do don't have to hear anything. I'm just you could do what you, you could do whatever you need to do. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. I, I I explained that to you already. Yes, I'm taking the pic, not your picture in particular, but the town hall in general. I already explained it to, to, to I already explained it to them, ma'am. Would you like me to explain it to you? Would you like me to explain it to you, ma'am? So I'm an, I'm an independent journalist. I'm gathering content for a story. There's no need for alarm, okay? This is a public building. You are not permitted to be recording in a government facility, so I ma'am, you're 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 you're, you're mis you're mistaken, and whoever told you that is is also mistaken, ma'am. I'm sorry. I'm not. I'm not trying to be difficult with you. I'm really not. I'm just. All I'm doing is, like if I told you. If you're trying to gather any kind of information, you can ask us whatever you want, rather than well, walking around with your video camera. Well, how do you know I wasn't going to get to that part? I'm not up because to that part yet. Because you haven't asked anybody. As I've only been here. Been walking around. I've only been. I've only been here for for eight minutes now. You've been recording for eight minutes. You haven't told anybody why or what you'd like. I, I told questions. Jerry why. I told you why. I told the, the woman over there. You why. You told me that you were an independent journalist. Journalist gathering content for but a story. you didn't ask me any questions yet. I, I'm not up to that part yet, and I don't have to ask you questions, ma'am. You, no, you have can, to answer my questions. I don't have to answer your questions. We can ask you to leave and not to record any longer. You, you could ask me to do that, yes. yes and I can, and I've I, asked you. And, and I can other polite. people in this office have also asked you to I'm do politely, that. I'm going to politely refuse that request because I'm not breaking any laws and I'm not, do, I'm not breaking any type of uh, laws or even policy, I'm sure. So, you know, okay. uh, if anything, um, I'm engaged in a constitutionally protected activity right now, ma'am. So that's all, you know. This is good education for everybody that works here. Can I speak to a supervisor, Jerry? I am the supervisor here. Oh, you are. Gotcha. I mean, Hi. you didn't, you didn't tell me that before. My name is Julie Chan. I'm the deputy town clerk for the town of Mount Hempstead. Uh, yes, we are in Town Hall 2, which is a 200 Clandome Road, and we have supposedly an independent journalist who is walking around our office recording on his cell phone, and he has been asked repeatedly to not record and also to leave the premise, and he refuses to do so. As quickly as possible. Like if I'm a like if I'm a criminal. <laughs> so this is a town hall two, Jerry? There's a town hall one? Yep. Okay. And what is that on the other side? I'm I'm gonna go over there too. I'm I'm sure when the police get here they're gonna explain everything to you guys, so it's not that big of a deal. Hi, how are you, ma'am? Good. Uh, you so said you're from the press? Yeah, ma'am. So, uh, can, can I ask who you are? Because the last lady, she wouldn't tell me who she was. Sure. And... I'm the deputy director of communications. Oh, great. Cool. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can and your, na and your name is? Rebecca. Rebecca. Nice yes. to meet you, Rebecca. So, I'm, I'm an independent jo journalist okay. gathering content for a story here sure. uh, in Town Hall. Mm -hmm. And uh, everybody here seems to be very upset that I'm recording. You know, I'm not sticking my camera into anybody's face. I'm, I'm not making any kind of disturbance. All I'm doing is just gathering content. What you guys have here in the building, okay. in Town Hall, what, which what is exactly what, are you looking for? No, I'm just I'm just taking pictures and videos of the building. Okay. I probably would have, uh, you know, this is not. I'm I'm here just to exercise my First Amendment right, freedom of press, 
in a public Usually, building? Um, people would just contact our office first so we can facilitate it. Yeah, I, I understand that, that that's a way you can do it, but yeah. you know, as far as rights go, I don't have to ask permission to exercise my rights, Rebecca. But I'm not trying to be difficult. You're not exercising your rights, more just like some courtesy, just like to let us know that you're here so we show you around. No, well, once I, once, once I got here, mm -hmm. I, I did explain why I was here. I didn't just, I don't have to do that either, Rebecca, but I did explain to you, to, to your people here that mm -hmm. what, to the employees here, what I, exactly I was doing. I didn't just stay quiet or anything, you know, and try and like start a response or anything. I told them I'm an independent journalist. Sure. I'm gathering content for a story, mm -hmm. which means looking at all these signs here, okay. checking out everything that's going on inside of town hall, mm -hmm. which is a public building. And now... Uh, this woman who didn't want to identify herself, I appreciate you identifying yourself. Uh, she's apparently calling the police on me, and you know, she's the police are just going to tell you the same thing I'm telling you if if they know the law that I'm able to record in a public building, man. Mm -hmm. And that's all I'm doing. Well, it's not, not an issue, but it's just disturbing the workplace and all that. So, if there's anything in particular you need, we can help you get that. Photos, no, no, no. That but, stuff, but, so. but, but, yeah. you're, you're clarif you're, uh, the, the way you say that I'm disturbing the workplace. It's kind of unfair because I, I'm I'm not. They're disturbing themselves, Rebecca. Well, it's you know? just more like people are not used to having. I understand. Camera, so. I can understand yeah. that part, mm -hmm. but I personally am not causing any kind of disturbance or disturbing anything. I'm not in anybody's way. I, I haven't even talked to anybody. I'm just simply gathering content for my story here. Mm -hmm. That's it. There's nothing else I'm doing. Right, That's yeah, it. That's fine. But okay. you know, in the ne next time you want to do something like this, I would appreciate it. you could reach out to our office. We'd help facilitate everything. Mm -hmm. Make sure everything's done, you know, appropriately. And, yeah. You know. And apparently she called the town uh the town lawyers and they said that couldn't do it. So, you know, it, it's just it's just surprising to me that public you seem to know, um, which is good, you seem to know that I have that I have the permission to be in here. Mm -hmm. But, you know, when you have a security guard, uh the deputy clerk, supervisor all these people over here, look, they're all stopping their jobs mm -hmm. for a man with a camera. So I'm not, you know, it might not be normal to them, mm -hmm. but it's normal to me because I'm a journalist. And that's all I'm doing. I'm just exercising my rights here today. And that's oh, it. Sure. Is there okay. anything else you need? I mean, well, like, no, you know, well, 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 well she, she, she did call the police on me. So I'm going to stay here and wait for the police to show up. So that way she can be educated by, by law enforcement and everybody else. They, they lock their doors over here. Mm -hmm. This is a public building. You can't lock doors. You know, somebody can somebody can file a lawsuit that they're refusing service, that they're Not locking the door. I don't think they're refusing service. I think it's more they're concerned. They weren't really aware of what you're doing. But I, I told, just, just like I told you, I told yeah. them. I told them. Well, I didn't just, I don't have to. You can be concerned. So. I know. You I, can be concerned, I, I, but, you know, it's, crazy world it's, there, it's so. good. It's a good thing that they have somebody like you working here that's going to come here and de-escalate the, the, the encounter because it, it's calling the police and doing all those kinds of things that's not... That's not what I'm here to do. I'm just here to just take pictures and videos of Town Hall, North Hampstead mm -hmm. Town Hall, right? Mm -hmm. That's where I am. Yeah, so that's all I'm trying to do, Rebecca, oh, really. Sure. Okay. So is there anything else you need? I mean, oh, well, I'm going to I'm gonna wait here. I'm going to wait here until law enforcement arrives because okay. she did call law enforcement on mm -hmm. me. So, you know, I'm going to make sure that law enforcement educates uh, this woman over here. And, um, okay. you know, that's it. And then I'll probably be on my way and you'll never see me again. Okay. But, I mean, is there anything else you need? Information or what? Um, no, not right now. Do you have a card? Not right now. No, I don't have any cards okay. on me, no. I don't have any cards on me, no. Okay. But thank you, Rebecca. I appreciate you coming and talking to me calmly and sure. you understanding the freedom of press aspect of this. So I appreciate that. Okay. Thank you, Rebecca. No problem. Thank you. Are you, are you this woman's uh, direct supervisor or no? I am not, no. Okay. Can, I work in the press office. Oh, okay, gotcha. So you, you're very familiar with the press then. Mm -hmm. So I, I would just like to speak to her supervisor to her supervisor that's if that's something you can help me out with oh i, I can't facilitate that so i mean there's anything you need like i said okay well that. i'll ask her ma'am can can i please speak to your supervisor please you can but he is not on premise right now he's not on prep what is he in the other side of the town hall no he's not here you only have one supervisor ma'am i do so nobody else is above you besides one person mm -hmm. okay well that's interesting and what would that person's name be and, Town and their Clark title? Wink. Town Clerk what? Wayne Wink. Wayne Wink? Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. And you're not going to give me your name, right? Julie Chen, Deputy Town Clerk. Sylvie Chen? Julie. Ju Julie Chen? Thank you. Appreciate it. Because, you know, the, the, way, the way you acted in calling law enforcement on me is not the proper response for something like this. I don't normally like to give my name to people who I don't trust. And well, who's walking around, well, I've asked you honest, times. Honestly, Sylvie, if you don't like giving your name to people, maybe you should find a different job where you don't work for the public. Maybe you should also find a different job. How about that? Don't judge me. But I'm not doing anything that's against my job, Sylvie. 
Uh, Julie, I'm Julie. I'm trying to protect myself and the people who work in this office. Protect you yourself are from not somebody? not making me feel protected at all or feel safe at all, which will be communicated to the police, which is exactly what I've already spoken to them about. I understand that. I don't think there's a single person who's watching this video who will watch it or who's watching it now who will disagree. I, I, I highly doubt that. <laughs> well, let's try. I highly doubt that. I highly doubt that. Julie Chen, deputy clerk. Thank you for coming so quickly. Hi. Hi, ma'am. How are you? What's going on? You? Good, good, good. I'm doing great. Do you want to talk to me outside so your privacy? Or do you want to talk to me? No, right we here? could talk here. Okay, That's whatever fine. you feel comfortable with. What's mm -hmm. going on? I so nothing. To the story. Yeah, no, nothing. I just walked in here and I'm filming. I'm, uh, okay, I'm, an, indi I'm an independent okay. journalist okay. gathering content for a story. Okay. And I was just filming like that map behind you and, you know, just different signs in here and, okay. you know, maybe ask a couple questions. But, you know, the, the employees here, they, the public employees here mm -hmm. were very hostile and got upset and concerned and... I can understand the concern, but when I'm talking to you and I'm telling you exactly what I'm doing here, okay. I'm not, I don't have to do that, but I'm telling you that I'm an independent journalist gathering yeah. content for a story. This is a town hall. What I have every right to be on? here. I'm, I'm not going to release that information okay. right now, but no, but I am working on a story and okay. you know, I appreciate it. Can I get your name and badge number, by the way? Uh, it's Officer Malarkey, uh -huh. 2919. You can right. see everything right here. Thank you. Okay. Appreciate it. Okay. So Officer Malarkey, yeah, that's that's basically all that's going on here. Okay. There's there's no nothing uh, nefarious afoot, just me gathering content and uh, ex exercising my First Amendment right. That's all. Okay, I understand that. Uh, I'm gonna talk to them. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure, I'm gonna be honest with you, I know certain places have rules. I'm gonna, sorry, let me roll on my radio. Yeah. <laughs> I know certain places, public places, do have rules about mm -hmm. cameras because due to other people's privacies, I'm gonna find out what their policy is. It's yeah. stated here and whatnot. So, my partner's here. Okay. So, I'm gonna find out what they're saying. Okay, mm -hmm. and then we'll figure it out. From just, there, just, right? just, just any policy that you have doesn't trump the uh, First Amendment of the Constitution. Just so Absolute, you know, and also sir, that the I onus is on them. Out, you know, no, no, no problem. Find out their time. Yeah, the onus trouble. is on them to, to protect their privacy. I just want to figure out their side of the story too. Yeah, of course. I'm hearing your side. Sure. Okay. So I'm just gonna talk to them, and we'll figure this out. Sure. All right. Sure. How you doing, sir? Can I get your name and badge number? Um, hold on a second. Sure. Just let, just let them talk. Okay? Sure, sure, sure. Don't worry about it. I don't know if you, what the rules are here. What are the rules in here? I called town attorney's office and we were told that because we're a government facility that we're not allowed to just walk around the place. Okay. Who said that? Town attorney. Okay. 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 Yes. Yeah. Right now, there's right 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 right. okay. Do you have an appointment? No. I, I I don't need one. I I got in without an appointment, sir. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, they're saying that they're. I'm not really sure if it's stated here, and we're gonna have to find out. You might have to make mm -hmm. an appointment. Would you yeah, maybe maybe if I that? maybe maybe if I needed services from somebody, I don't need any services from anybody. Well, don't you want to ask some questions though for your journal? Well, no, because I need an appointment to do that, so I'm not gonna go through that. I'm just taking pictures of the signs and you know everything that's everything I can see from public, ma'am. That's all. Okay. That's all. That's all I'm doing here today. I'm sorry. That's your reason for being here. Yeah, I'm a independent journalist oh, gathering okay. content yeah. for a story, sir. Oh, mm -hmm. He's doing a story. Um, he doesn't really want to disclose it right now, which I said's fine. But he just wants. He wanted that. But you do want to okay, ask but some don't questions. We have a right Maybe. To put him on camera? Well, you have no expectation of privacy in public, ma'am. I, I do. I'm not sure I'm a person. What this place entails. It's a public place. Yeah. I'm a human being that has a right to be recorded or not recorded. No, no. You should choose a different profession, ma'am. Honestly, I'm not trying to be. I'm not trying to be an a hole with you. I'm just trying to say that you're a public employee. Are you almost done? Or what? Well, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll, I'll be done in a few minutes. I'll be done in a few minutes. Maybe just wrap it up because. Everybody in here feels uncomfortable. Yeah, I mean, I know, I, I know you have the right and, and what you're saying, yeah. but for them, yeah, they feel uncomfortable. They got work to do. Mm -hmm. They should I, just. Uh, I'm just gonna fade into the background. They can get back to their yeah, work, know, and it's, you know, it's, it's uncomfortable for anybody that they know they know they're being videoed. All the time. I know, but they're just trying to work. I, I didn't go. I didn't go up to people and start recording them, officer. And can I get your name and badge number, please? It's Andrew Miro, right there. I can't see that for Thank you. Okay. All right. All right. Come on. Let's let's well, let's 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 let's, let's, let's stay professional here. I am being professional. Let's stay professional. Sean, Sean, you can continue. Yeah, I haven't been here for half hour. Continue, but there are other people that are performing private business here. You can continue doing, but once you're finished, yeah, and I don't. Yeah, but there's no more business for you to be performed, and you're. 
business has stopped, then you can leave. Re res respectfully, Malarkey, you don't, you do not tell me when my business is finished. Absolutely. Respectfully. I'm that, and I'm speaking respectfully to you too, mm -hmm. as well. Okay. But, I mean, I'm just trying to under, I'm trying to help both sides. Yeah. And you're saying that you're recording, you're trying to get everything at a certain point, like how long you're going to stay here. Yeah, they, but the, the, they are seeing that they're only, I'm on, I'm on the side, I'm on the side following the law. They're on the side just of, their own personal opinion. I'm, I'm, I'm following the law. I'm exercising a First Amendment we understand right. Understand that. We're just trying to say, can you be considerate? Like, yeah. Well, as soon as, as soon as I'm, as soon as I'm, as soon as I'm, if you could just be considerate. They weren't very Wrap considerate. Up, get you, whatever you gotta do, get. Do you, go. officer, do you think that calling the police on somebody is is a considerate? Is it, well, they they weren't being considerate of me? Room that you're not supposed to be That's not a private room, room sir. According to them, it is. They work here. They said private room. That, that door was wide open, sir, and it says, "Please come in right there. You can read it." So it's an right, invitation so to come in. I didn't go. Then, great. Up, great, great. One, two, three, four, five people not doing their jobs. Normally, you're supposed to get permission across the street before you do this. No, no. Fifty years, you're supposed to go across the street, show your credentials, and get permission. No, ma'am. No, that's not true. Not true. I'll, I'll speak to her. Yeah, sure. Camera there. Two cameras up there. Thank you. All right, no problem. Yeah. All right, Take care. All right, so apparently there's a uh, another side to town hall. We're gonna go check that one out now. Hopefully, find Julie's boss. Thanks, Jerry. You're welcome. Have a good day. You too. All right, guys. So we just left the uh, first building. That was Town Hall that had the building division, uh, town clerk. So this is another building. We're going to check this one out. North Hempstead has multiple uh, Town Hall buildings. This one has uh, Human Resources, Info Technology, Comptroller, Town Attorney. The same Town Attorney who... Uh, was so ignorant and said that I couldn't film here. Supervisor, deputy supervisor, boardroom, town board services, purchasing, administration services. Sir, sir, sir. Yes. You come down? No. Do you have an appointment? Yeah, I'm not sir, coming down. Sir, do you have an appointment? Excuse me? Do you have an appointment? This is not a restricted area, no. sir. This is not a restricted area, sir. This is town hall. Right, so, so I would ask that you, any, uh, I would ask, here? I would ask that you stay, stand down, please, stand, stand down. I'm standing right here. Stand down. Stand down. I don't need an appointment to be here. Okay. This is a town hall. Thank I am, you. I'm I conducting that. business. I don't think you do understand. You're I trying do. to, you're trying to keep me and prevent my movement. I'm not. I'm just asking you if you have an appointment. I have business here. Okay. Did you not just see the two police officers over there? Stand down, everybody. Just the guy with the camera. What's your name, sir? I'm Stephen Pollock. Stephen who? What? Stephen Pollock. What's your name? Stephen Pollock? Yes. Yeah, what's I'm your not, name? I didn't give it. I okay. didn't give it. Great. And nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. Work on. You got to be a little bit, a little bit more friendly. Yeah. A little bit more friendly, Thank and you'd you. be, you'd be great. Uh, what position do you hold here at the town hall? I am the director of governmental research. Wow. What is it? What do you do? What is that? Uh, what does that entail? Director of governmental research. Yeah. Yeah. So what does that what does that entail? Uh, Obviously, well, following journalists around is that part of your job description? Well, I just want to make sure that you have the appropriate. Are you doing research you on on journalists? Is that what? You have made other employees feel uncomfortable, and I was called to just see what was going on. Oh, okay. Because I care about my coworkers. Oh, okay. You can. 
Does it does it look like I'm I'm gonna you be made committing them any feel crime? Very uncomfortable. So that's why I was called. So uncomfortable is like a state of mind. You know what I mean? So they need they can change that on their own and not be uncomfortable I'll because tell them to feel that way. You know what I mean? Because a, a camera, how does a camera make you feel uncomfortable? It's there's, not there's, normal. There's, there's, there's I understand what you're doing. It's there's, awful, there's, but, uh, there's, it's not there's, normal that people there's cameras are everywhere over here, Steve. Steve there's, Steve, there's cameras everywhere, right? You're kidding me? I have no idea. So why don't they feel uncomfortable with those cameras? So it's for did, security purposes. Did you, but did you know that I can get the video footage from those cameras, Steve? You're a foil. I'm familiar. Okay. So what's right. the difference between me using my own I'm not recording device? Sure talking about. So you asked me what my name was. You asked me what my title. Okay. Was. All right. Great. Did you check in for your visit? Did I check in? Yeah. No. Visitors come here to check in. You should check in. Typically? Yeah. Yeah. Meeting everybody, so you should check in. No, I'm not no. gonna check in. Oh, no. That's weird. What do you? What do you? What does checking in entail, Steve? Uh, checking with public safety to let them know why you're here and what you're doing. No, but what? What does that entail? You should ask Joey. I'll tell you. But, I mean, you're the one talking. Joe's not talking to me about it. You are. So that's I'm asking you. That's completely irrelevant. You should check in with Joey, please. No, Joe hasn't talked to me about it, so. Please I'm, hold on right here, please. Thank you. What's up, Joe? Uh, you need my driver's license. Yeah. Really? Yeah. To en to enter in a town hall? Yeah. Wow. Do you do that with everybody? Yeah. Every single person that comes into town hall, you see, you 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 tell them, you make them give you your driver's license. Yeah. Did you know that's a violation of the Fourth Amendment? Yeah. So. Yeah, I'm trying to speak to the town attorney. This is very this is very concerning right. that you're forcing right. free American citizens to. Relinquish their driver's license, which is a violation of the Fourth Amendment. Listen, I don't make the rules. I understand. Well, you're not going to get my license. I'm not going to allow you to violate my rights to enter in a, a public building. But that's something I will take up with the town attorney for sure. Thanks, Joe. Interesting. You have to give up your driver's license to enter into town hall. He did not say give up. He said to give it to him. To check it out. To check you in. Yeah. No, you don't. You, that's not how it works. You have a Fourth Amendment protection of search and seizure, seizure of my identity. That's how do we know that you're a constituent of the town, or how do we know what your business is here? I'll check in. No, have see, you been because to Nassau County? because you don't you don't need business to be in a town hall. You don't need you have don't you need business. Any other town hall? Have I've been to I've been to plenty of town halls, and I have not checked into not one of them. That's but interesting. I'd like to go with you. But yeah. I think that's true. Yeah. Well, I mean. Sometimes they will. I have seen people have the same policy here. And just so you know, Steve, policy, it goes constitution, laws, policies. So if the policy breaks the law, like when we had policies about colored people using going into restaurants, that was a policy, right? But it violated the law. So just because it's a policy doesn't mean it's right. And this is why I do what I do, because now I found a town hall who requires people to surrender their identification to enter it. Which is unconstitutional. No to you to surrender your license. You are misusing. He, he just requests. he just asked me for my. He said that everybody who comes into and surrender. You're know, using two different words. Have you ever purchased something that requires you to be a certain age? I'm sorry. Have you ever purchased something that requires you to be a certain age with medication? Yeah. Uh huh. Of course. Yeah, you show them your ID. They yes. Look at it. Verify your credentials. Yes. And they give it back. That's all it was going to be. Yeah. No, but what I'm saying is that. Yes, you need ID to purchase tobacco products or alcohol or stuff like that. But what? But my and I understand that, and I understand your point. But my point is, is that this is a public building that's open to the public, that it belongs to every public citizen here. So that's unreasonable. You know what I mean? That's that that would be unreasonable. And I understand that's not your rules, Joe, and it, it might it, it might not be even your rules, Steve. But it's something that uh. I'm definitely going to be pursuing and following up on with the town attorney. But I, I understand what you were trying to say, Joe, but it just it's not applicable here. Thanks. You should know who's in the building. I think that's a good idea. You should know who's in the building? Yeah. Interesting. This is an emergency. That would be smart, right? I don't know. I don't think anything's smart that requires people to... Uh, check in? To I guess uh, when I go on an airplane, I shouldn't check in. Well, that's a private, that's that's a, that's a private business. That's a private business. Right. This like, is a public... Knowing who's on a plane it's important to know. For yeah, no, reasons. I agree with the plane. I don't agree with Town Hall at all. This is a public building, Steve. Right. So Thanks. We can continue to do this. Yeah, time. yeah, no, I know. Thank you. Sir, did you check in? Who, who are I'm you? I'm an employee. Who are you? 
No, what's your name and position here, sir? What's your name? Do you have an ID? Are you, oh, are you the town attorney? I'm not. What's your name? Uh, so I don't really want to talk to you then. What's your I name? Thought, I thought you were somebody that was going to be able to Do you to have an ID? You, you identified yourself as being part of the press? Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm an independent journalist, yeah. Do you have an ID? Credentials? No, I don't need that. That's not what I need. But what, who, you're a public employee, so shouldn't you identify yourself to the public? I'm not here to be interviewed today, sir. We just want to make sure that there's no security. Excuse risk me, sir. Risk. Security risk. So I don't, I don't know who you are. So I'm not going to continue to talk to you because I don't know who you are. Just please check in as a security risk. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. Why not? Because I don't have to. I hope so. That'd be great. Sure. Which is what we're doing. We're just concerned that. But why would you be concerned? I'm gonna call you. I'm gonna call you. Hey, hey, hey! Nobody's talking to you. Nobody's talking to you. I'm talking. I'm talking. I'm talking to this gentleman. I'm talking to this gentleman. No, I have not. No, I have not. You have been rude. You have been rude. You have been rude, Steve. I'm not going to surrender my Fourth Amendment right to check into a public building. There's a policy that's posted on the door. Yeah. Who are you, ma'am? As, in what capacity? Why does nobody want to say what capacity? You guys are you guys are public employees. I don't understand. What is the big secret? You know, I could I could find out your name, your your address, everything about you. You're a public employee. You understand that, right? You too, ma'am. So, but that's what I'm trying to say. Why can't you just tell me who you are? What do you do here? Why don't you tell us who you are and how we can help you? But I'm not a public employee, ma'am. Am I asking you to? Am I asking you to do an interview? I'm asking you your name. I'm asking for your name and. I'm asking for your name and your position here. I'm not asking for anything. I'm not cursing. I'm not yelling. I'm not doing anything. I'm just you talk to me. I didn't come up to you. You don't want to be interviewed, but yet you're the one that talked to me. If you didn't want to be interviewed, you should have just kept on about your day, sir. I just want to make sure that the building is safe and that there are no... How do I know who you are? How do I know How do I know who you are? That you have any authority to be talking to me right now? You could just be some random guy off the street, right? You have no authority to tell me anything in this building. Neither does Steve, neither does Joe, neither does Rich. Everybody else gave me their names. What's no, the secret? We don't, none of us want to do this. We just want to go on back our work. So you can do so, that. Okay, You're free to so do that. Please feel free to sit. You can stand in this area. Yeah. Sure. The rooms that are uh, beyond access, you yeah, so what you're doing, you're just, you're, all you're doing, all you're doing now is trying to tell me something so you can walk out of here and feel like you won. But you can go back to your, I'm going to call you, no, I'm going to call, I'm going to call, I'm going to call you no name. I'm going to call, nobody's talking to you again, Steve. I'm going to call you no name because you don't want to give me your name. No name, ma'am. I'm sorry. If there is a policy, you know, I, I would just, just for educational purposes, a policy does not trump the rights of, uh, yes, but our building, of the people. You, what, you it's not your, no, 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 that's, that's a big, that's a big mistake, ma'am. It's not your building. You just how you just said that. That's the mentality public employees in this have. Building, the policy yeah, this is, is my building. Signing. This is our building together. Are you a North Hempstead resident? It, 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 that doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's it's our building. It's our building, ma'am. It's my building. So your building. You. I'm not. I, not you got. You can go. You guys can go about your day. We, we are. So great. Thank you. Thank so you. You have your video. That's great. You can go about I'm your day now. To to you. We're not having a constitutional argument. I hope not. But I'm sure you didn't come here to, to demean public employees, right, by saying... That's I, didn't, I didn't come here to talk to any public employees. Okay. Public employees decided to talk to me, sir. Okay. So this has been a pleasure, of course. Great. So Have a great day. Two public safety officers, we've asked you to sign in mm -hmm. as every resident and other... Uh, oh, I'll, I'll, I'll be... Sure. So so what you're telling me is that... I'm the, not saying it's, anything, sir. We've asked you to do it. You've declined to do it. That's fine. We're gonna oh, okay. Public great. Safety officers no, I, I want to get that policy changed. That's all I'm saying. Me personally. Sir, that's, that's, I'll be at the next town meeting. Sir, I know what I'm doing. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What was your name again? <laughs> nice try. I didn't give my name. Oh, okay. I didn't give it. You didn't give yours either. Okay. And there's a difference. You're a public employee. I'm not. Okay. So shame on you for not giving your name. You to identified it. yourself as press and then haven't disclosed any credentials. Because I don't need to. I don't need but to. You did it for the police. I don't need right? to. Because the police were being courteous to me and they were being nice <laughs> to me. Courteous. This is. This can be an 
No, no, no. Look, you got one, two, three, four, five people all surrounding me because I'm walking around with the camera. I'd be happy to leave. I'm just, all I'm doing is walking around with the camera. That's all I'm doing. We're good. We're going to go upstairs. Great. Have a, have a nice day. You guys can follow me around and uh, do what you need to do. All right, guys. So this is the main town hall building, which I went to second, which has the town attorney, supervisor, and a few other offices in it. Where we went first, where the Nassau County Police were called, is over here. That has the building division and the town clerk in it. So all in all, you know, guys, it was definitely a pretty rough audit. A lot of people coming at me from different angles, you know, being very rude, uneducated. They actually uh, talked to the town attorney and the town attorney actually told them that I wasn't allowed to film in a government building. So that's pretty scary when the town attorney doesn't know the law. Also, apparently, everybody that enters this building has to give up their driver's license and ID themselves. Everybody except me, of course, because I refused. Very concerning that you would have to give up your Fourth Amendment right of search and seizure of your identity just to get into a building that we own, we the people. But we're here to educate. We're not here to uh, antagonize or anything like that. Hopefully they learn their lesson. Nassau County Police Department definitely gets an A-plus in my book. You know especially uh officer uh malarkey the other officer not so much but uh he was a little uh sarcastic and rude but at the end of the day i'm gonna follow back up with this town hall here maybe i'll go check out a uh town hall uh meeting so uh and bring up my concerns there about them identifying people entering their building and i'll be able to talk to the town attorney hopefully soon about his uh, thoughts on public photography and the First Amendment. As always, guys, stay safe. God bless. I'll see you in the next video. Long Island Audit. Peace.